Hey everybody, welcome back to the Workbench series where we do work on the bench. Today we're going to take a look at a fan center that has a double pole single throw relay in it. We're going to look at the difference between that and the single pole double throw. So this here fan center has the single pole double throw relay. We can see that there are two wires here on the secondary soldered on to G and C that go around here to the coil of the relay and we have terminal 1, terminal 2, and terminal 3. What we're going to focus on here is this particular one and if we look at the secondary of the transformer there are five terminals on here R and C which put out our 24 volts and then we have a W, a G, and a Y and we've got four wires on this one soldered in place and they run around to the back here to the relay. Now the black and the blue down here go to the coil of the relay. Let's unplug this relay so we can see what kind of relay we're dealing with here. We'll take this little bracket out which keeps it from popping out when the relay is energized. And this is a 24 volt coil pilot duty relay. And this particular relay has four terminals we're looking at 1 and 3 and 4 and 6 and then we have down here the coil of the relay 24 volt coil these two terminals energize it these are normally open contacts and this relay more works more like a, an on off type switch where it turns a load on and then it turns it off when the coil is de-energized and if we take a look we have a wire here connected to R it's a red wire that runs around the back and it runs to the number four terminal. So this terminal is going to be, the way this is set up, already have 24 volts going into the relay. And when the relay is energized, it will come out of number six here. And if we look, number six has a yellow wire inside of it. And again, comes back to this Y terminal where it's soldered in place. So if we're going to Typically this is used in a, a boiler to energize the burner circuit. The 1 and 3 would be used to energize our circulator. And this 4 and 6, the auxiliary terminals, are used for the burner circuit. We can see it in a furnace application where we have a, a single speed blower and we use this 24 volt circuit to energize an auxiliary uh, circuit. So again, we have four wires that are soldered in place, G and C, which will energize the coil of the relay, black and blue there. And then we have 24 volts coming from R, going into the relay at 4, and when the relay is energized, it comes out here at 6 to the Y terminal. We can stake a wire on here and run it to whatever it is we're going to power up. We have the black and white wires here that power up the primary of the transformer and then we have terminals one and three here where we run line voltage in and out to usually our circulator or single speed fan that we're going to use it to turn on and off. So again this is a plug-in style relay that plugs right into the plastic harness there and then we make sure we put the little bracket back in place so that the relay doesn't pop out when we energize it. So again, two different styles of fan center. Here we have the double pole single through re relay. We have four wires soldered in place. And here we have the single pole double throw relay where we have just the coil wires soldered in place. Taking a little bit of mystery out of the fan center. This has been the Workbench Series. I'd like to thank you for joining me, and I'll see you on the next one.